We're going to have a tour of Comic-Con, which is now so big that it uses the meeting rooms from the adjoining hotels for film and anime screenings, but in this tour we're only going to concentrate on the convention center. This is the autograph area, and this year there will be stars like Guillermo del Toro, the cast from True Blood, Torchwood, Doctor Who, and many, many others. There's a portfolio review section. This is where aspiring cartoonists and artists get their work reviewed by and critiqued by industry peers. And one of the things that I really love about Comic-Con is all the photo opportunities. You know, everybody is dressed up in costumes and you can take pictures everywhere. And for example, look, there's Doctor Who. And you know, Matt Smith is like the best thing that could have happened to tall, pale guys. This is the convention center floor. Today is Thursday, so the first day it opens and the best day to record since it's not too crowded yet. On the, there's a section on the convention floor, there's a section that has to do with old school paper comics and there's, you can find your, the editions you're looking for. More or less in the middle of the convention is where all the big buy, big guys and big budgets are. Uh, you know, DC, Marvel Comics, um, Dark Horse, Hollywood, you know, that's where the good stuff is. And of course, uh, Star Wars is always present. It's one of those franchises that just keeps on giving. Every year there seems to be something new, either a picture or game or something has to do with Star Wars. And it wouldn't be complete without the ladies that dress as Princess Leia. Uh, yes, as you can see, this is a very popular costume. Now, there is also a section for gamers. And in the convention floor, you'll see all the video games. And sometimes they have tournaments or uh, I think they just go and play and show all the newest stuff that's going to be coming soon. And there's also the old school, you know, role playing type games, um, which I don't know too much about. But, you know, there it is. You know, people can do that as well in Comic-Con. Uh, in these rooms, uh, people can go to different panels that can be, you know, about writing, costumes, fandom, cult shows, comics, whatever. Like this panel that I went to it had to do with HP Lovecraft movies, and they were promoting a musical and a film festival that's coming soon. And of course, you know, Comic Con is in San Diego, so whenever you get fed up with the crowds and everything, you can always go outside. Uh, enjoy the view, get some sun, and just get some fresh air.